All right, boys and girls, today I'm going to be walking you through migration. What is migration? Many animals move from one place to another or migrate. Most animals migrate to find a warmer climate. So what does climate mean? Here we go. Climate, the usual weather in a place. So most animals migrate so that they can find a warmer place to live. Some migrate to look for food or water. Others migrate to mate and have their babies. So let's talk about a little bit about geese. So geese, geese migrate south in the fall. They move to a warmer habitat during winter. In the spring, they migrate north again. So some of them migrate two or three times a year. They either move to a warmer place or to a hotter place, or sometimes they migrate for food, or maybe they want to have their children in a warmer place. Let's talk about mon monarchs. Monarch butterflies migrate away from cold weather. They fly south each fall. Many fly long distances from Canada to Mexico. And you can see the monarch butterflies here. It would be very hard for a monarch butterfly to live through a snowstorm. So most of the time during the winter, they fly south. Now, in Africa, wild beasts migrate to find food and water. They don't move, they don't migrate because of weather, but they move, they migrate because of um, food and water. During the dry season, they migrate north, they migrate south for the rainy season. And what's very interesting as well is that migration is also very hard. It's not an easy thing. Sometimes they get hungry. Sometimes there's predators that eat them. So migrating is not an easy thing for animals. Another animal that we can look at is salmon. Adult salmon migrate up rivers to mate and lay eggs. So they actually migrate up rivers. Sometimes they die. After the young hatch, they migrate to the ocean. So they go back to the ocean. So I'm actually going to show you the video here on Pebble that shows migration. It actually shows fish migrating. So let's take a look. So I'm sure some of you guys caught that the fish were flying. They were trying to migrate at the same time of the river current. Now, boys and girls, today you have access to PebbleGo. I will put the username and password for PebbleGo so that you can also search migration. All you would need to do is type migration up in here. If you want to learn more about migration, you could click more and they show you different types of animals that migrate as well as a book on animal migration. On your assignment today, I have also posted a video. It is Lady walking you through migration and big animal trips that they take. Lastly, you have your assignment today. This is what your assignment looks like. It says migration. It says drag the sentences to the correct column. So what you're going to do is you're going to read the sentence and then you're going to decide whether it's true or false after you have watched my video as well as the video that I have attached onto the assignment. The last thing that you're going to share about migration is the two most interesting things I've learned about migration is. So I want you to share two interesting facts that you learned about migration. You're going to type number one and number two. If you have any questions on migration today or you'd like to know more about migration, you can always contact me. You can comment or you can set up a live session and I'd be happy to help you. Otherwise, you may get started with your assignment.